We are seeing unprecedented times when it comes to AI and ML. AI and ML have become game changers in today's world, transforming the way we live and work, from personalized experiences to predictive insights. These technologies are unlocking new levels of efficiency, productivity, and innovation. Hello, this is Avani Tagarwala from Bestman Global, which is helping customers realize the benefit of AI and ML on AWS and other clouds. Let me take you through some of the key services AWS offers in the area of AI ML, and I'm sure you will benefit from the enriching session. Bestman Global is a top cloud MSP. We are a top tier partner with AWS, Azure, and GCP. We have 12 global offices across eight countries. We are in the Gartner Magic Quadrant for five consecutive years, and the number speaks for themselves. We have over 3,000 plus customers. We have Samsung, Hyundai, to name some, and we have about 1,100 cloud experts, and all of them, 800 plus are certified. We are into multiple areas of cloud retail, professional services, managed services, and you can benefit from one or more of these services that we have to offer to our customers. Now, AWS has been ranked in the leaders quadrant and the ability to execute in the AI and ML developer service. And you can see that the latest Gartner Magic Quadrant. AWS enables end-to-end -end data strategy and shows how various data sources are utilized across AWS services to store the data, query, integrate, and act on it. AI ML services come in. One, we need to uh, get the insights from the data and also help predictive and prescriptive analytics in an automated way. AWS SageMaker is the key AML services of AWS, which is a whole suite of services in itself, which enables to, you to uh, do end-to-end -end ML capability for an organization, which without leaving the AWS ecosystem. There are new features of the reInvent 2022, like Amazon Data Zone. Uh, it's in preview, you need to request for that. It's a data management service that you can use to publish data and make it available to the business data catalog through your personalized web application. We can access data regardless of where it is stored on AWS, on-prem, or SaaS applications like Salesforce and others. Amazon Data Zone simplified the experience across AWS services like Amazon Redshift, Athena, Glue, at AWS Leak Formation and Amazon QuickSight. AI is a system that is capable of performing a task that previously required human intelligence. It has been in existence for over 50 years and due to cloud computing, it is being adopted into mainstream at a rapid pace. It's worth to talk about the technologies under AI that is used today, in, like machine learning. Machine learning uses a probabilistic approach, investing huge amounts of data used that data to train the model and predict the outcome based on initial model. The data used to train the model needs to be clean and without bias as much as possible. There are two different techniques under ML and are also popular. First one is uh, deep learning that works like the brain mimicking its neural network to make predictions which are more accurate due to its complex nature. Mainly used for computer vision, speech recognition, using a large amount of data to train the neural network and capable of doing The second one is reinforcement learning and takes a different approach and functions in, their, in the way rewards and punishments approach, where it rewards the right prediction and penalizes the wrong prediction to improve the accuracy. Mainly used in autonomous driving, uh, drones, robots. NLP is another uh, branch of AI, which gives the machines the capability to understand text and spoken words as humans can. It combines the computational linguistics or rule-based model of human language with statistical ML and deep learning. Together, these technologies enable machines to process human language in the form of text or voice 
data and to understand its full meaning with this, what the speaker or writer is intent is or sentiment is. Now we come to the key challenges in AI and ML adoption. This is highlighted here. Uh, there are the, there are multiple areas. However, the four top areas which are lack of skills about approximately 19%, data quality of the organization might not have good data to be able to implement AI ML on that. Identifying use cases, there are organizations who are sitting on plethora of data, but may not be having the use case that they need to be able to harness the data and make it work for their organization. And then the urgency to uh, implement AI. It could be cost, it could be data quality, or it could be simply identifying the use case. So the company never really finds it urgent to be able to move forward with the use case in implementing AI and all. Now I take you to the AWS uh, track on how the organizations can interact with various services of AWS. So at the bottom, uh, this is where organizations who already have AIML on-prem can deploy and run it on AWS infrastructure. Specific CPUs, GPUs are available to run those models which require a lot of computational powers efficiently. So you can see PyTorch, Apache, MaxNet, Hugging Face, Hugging Face, TensorFlow. So all those are the ML framework which uh, any organization can utilize on AWS. The ML service layer is SageMaker. Build your own model. This tool comes into picture. This is an end-to-end -to -end tool that will look at uh, in detail. Above that level, we have all the core AI services, starting with basic ones like text, document processing, chatbots, speech recognition, vision. At the top, we have the most complex and specific services like personalization, forecasting, and an industrial space like predictive maintenance, embedded AI services in the application. Now, AWS boasts a lot about no-code, low-code, where you do not need to be a data scientist or AI ML expert. You bring the model and you are able to use the AWS services or utilize a lot of inbuilt models that AWS SageMaker and other tools has to offer, which can greatly quicken your model deployment and get the output from there. This is a quick overview of the AI services that, that are available on AWS. Those are all the high-level AI services in terms of the augmented AI, Code Guru, Comprehend, DevOps Guru, Forecast, Fraud Detector, Kendra, Lookout for Metrics, Personalize, Recognition, Textract, Transcribe, Translate. It's a mouthful, I know, but you can see what each of the services do there. And those are which you can implement easily and able to get the results from the data that you are in your organization. You have that in. So coming to AWS SageMaker, the AWS SageMaker is the ML service that we were talking about. This is the high-level overview of AWS SageMaker and a typical ML model lifecycle and how the idea of AWS SageMaker component fits into the ML lifecycle. Starting with preparation of the data, building the model, training and tuning the model to finally deploying and managing the model. SageMaker supports end-to-end -end ML lifecycle. These are the areas AWS SageMaker is used typically to build innovative ML solutions and solve business use cases like forecasting, predictive analytics, maintenance, accelerate NLP solutions for business use case, uh, scalability, uh, is scalable, and the capability of SageMaker required for large scale workloads in document processing. Modernize the ML platforms, self manage workloads, ML app helps to operationalize and automate the ML lifecycle. 